What a mess. And this is not your normal sludge from a backed up sewer. A lot to get to here today at six. Good to have you with us. A Garden City homeowner says she couldn't believe what she was seeing or for that matter, smelling. And today's effort to clean it up didn't quite get the job done. It turns out the backyard of a home on Harrison Street near Ford Field or Ford Road, I should say, was filled with grease. Coco McAvoy joins us with what's causing the giant mess. It's a nasty combination of grease and muck underneath this deck in Garden City. And the homeowner, Renee Fonda, wants to know who's going to clean it up. And sickening. Sickening and smelly. I don't even know what you would call this besides a mess. A greasy mess. Where did it come from? There was plumbing trucks next door at KFC cleaning out the pipes and all of a sudden there was like an eruption of a volcano filling her yard with grease. Now it was coming up through here through this drain and get this. It isn't the first time. The first time it happened, they tore out my whole um, backyard and replaced the, um, the pipe. That was in November of 2015. I never ever thought this would happen again. This time around, city staff worked hard to clean up the majority of the mess in the yard, but they took off the boards underneath the deck and found out that the whole deck is still all full of grease. Fonda was told to call her insurance company to deal with the rest of the grease and got nowhere. I'm stuck with this smelly, yucky grease everywhere. Local 4 called the Garden City City Manager Doc Dockerty. He says Fonda's sewer line is connected to KFC's. The city is investigating to see if KFC is responsible for the mess. But I just want the problem fixed. My house is my Haven. Fonda hopes this will be the last time her haven is invaded by Greece. And after we spoke with the city manager, city crews came back out here to the house. They've been out here for about an hour now, and Fonda tells us that they're doing everything they can, given their resources, to clean up the rest of the grease and try to fix the problem. Back to you. So, Coco, this has a possibility of being chicken grease. Is, is anybody from KFC saying anything about it? Yes, actually, I just got off the phone with someone from corporate at KFC, and she tells me that they're right now calling the franchisee owner to try to figure out and investigate what might possibly be happening because Garden City officials believe there's a possibility that KFC employees are dumping grease down the drain instead of using the grease trap. Of course, that's just an allegation, so KFC corporate is trying to get to the bottom of this. All right, okay, more to come. Keep us posted, Coco.